Yeah, I came to Texas to take care of my mother. And I had a real well-paying job. I used the credit cards a lot, but I was paying double and triple payments on every one of them. And I lost that job and wasn't able to replace that income and could not pay my, my debt. Well, when I got the judgment, I never got a letter to, to, to appear in court, so I didn't get a chance to defend myself. So let's say you get a letter in the mail from a local court that says you've been sued by a debt collector. What do you do? Don't panic and don't ignore it. Instead, read the documents and identify who is suing you and how much they say you owe. If you think it might be a scam, you can call the court where the case is filed to make sure a case has actually been filed. You must respond in writing and file your response with the court before the filing deadline. If you don't respond, you automatically lose, and the judgment might appear on your credit report. In Texas, you have 14 to 20 days to answer, depending on the court. Your answer can be a handwritten letter to the court saying you disagree with the lawsuit. Our toolkit also has a sample answer form you can use. Be sure to include the case number, your mailing address, and any reasons you should not have to pay. These reasons are called defenses. Here are some possible defenses. The amount is wrong. The account isn't mine. The debt is older than four years. I already paid the debt. If the debt is yours and you don't have any defenses in the lawsuit, one option is to negotiate a payment plan with a creditor. There are credit counselors available who can help. Find a credit counselor by visiting the Consumer Information section of the Federal Trade Commission's website. Remember, it is important to respond. Otherwise, you lose automatically. For more information, go to our toolkit at mydebtcollectionrightstexas.org.